Although there are multiple ways to create a connection between two platforms, such as operating systems, it seems difficult to transfer files from Linux distributions to Windows and vice versa. It is pretty simple and straightforward if you know exactly how to do it. If you are a beginner like me you don't need to worry about it. Just watch this video and find out the way. It will shows you how to transfer files from WSL to Windows. Welcome to Newbie Computers Channel. I will create a folder for test purpose. You can see the contents of the newly created folder is empty. First thing first, before you can even begin you have to understand where all the Linux files are placed in your Windows 10. To avoid any accidental tampering Microsoft stores all your Linux files under the following hidden folder, percent user profile percent backslash app data backslash local backslash packages. Here you can find your Linux distribution packages, double click on the folder for your distribution, in this video I am using a Debian distro for an example. Select the local state folder, then root fs. This is the root file share where all your files are placed. Then go to the folder where you want to place the file to be copied. In this example I will copy the file and save it in the forward slash home forward slash debian forward slash test folder that was created earlier. You can simply move or copy paste files inside one of these Linux directories, but if the files don't appear in your Windows subsystem for Linux bash shell you may need to restart it. After we copy the files, let's check on Linux whether the files already exist in the folder we created earlier. Now you can see all the files that were copied earlier have been saved in that folder. Windows subsystem for Linux provides you access to the Windows 10 system drive by mounting the C, colon backslash. On Linux if you go to your root directory and list all directories, then you will notice a forward slash mnt forward slash c forward slash which is windows 10 c colon backslash mounted on linux for test purpose i will empty the test folder that we created earlier with the command rmrf let's see exactly where we are we will use the folder as the destination of the file copying that we will do later now go to the forward slash mnt folder Check the contents of the folder, in this example you can see the C, D, E, and F folders. We will try to copy the files from Windows in the E, colon backslash temp folder. Here we can see the files in the folder. We will copy all these files to Linux in the destination folder forward slash home forward slash debian forward slash test with the cp command. After we copy them, let's check if the files have been copied in the destination folder. You can also copy files from Linux to Windows in this way.